Hi, I'm Barbara on the business development team at Economic Change, and we're very excited to share your local pantry story with you today. Last week, I interviewed Catherine, one of the project managers we worked with, and she'll explain to you what your local pantry does. So I'm the program manager at Church Action on Poverty, and we've been supporting pantries around the country to open through your local pantry. Um, we'd, we're an organisation that's focused on ending poverty and taking action on poverty. So our pantries are member-led food shops that are locally based, that fair share stock, and they members go in, they go in and do a weekly shop between £3.50 and £5, and they get 10 items, saving them a, around... 15 to 20 pounds every week off their shop. Great. I then asked Catherine, how did she feel that the working relationship went with economic change? Yeah, so the organisation who had been working with Stockport Homes, who founded the model, and we were thinking about what would we need if we were going to set up a network of pantries. So at the time, I think there were only there was five in Stockport, but there were only a couple in our network. Um, and it's a big leap to make from two to 300 pantries. And we weren't really sure how we would measure what was happening in the pantries, how many children we would be supporting, the number of people, how many members there were, how often people were visiting. Um, and Salesforce allowed us to do that. And the reason that we wanted to work with economic change was that they just understood what we needed as a solution. So we didn't know what it was yet. We didn't know that we were going to need this dashboard where everything was really easy to understand, that we were going to need an app that was that we have on tablets that pantries use to check people in and out and manage their customers. And I think for us, it just works. But for us, the relationship with economic change worked as well. And, and that's been something that, that we want to continue as, as we grow Salesforce and we develop and innovate. Um, and it was a bit of a barrier previously because we had no way to manage people's memberships or support our pantries to do it. So we've gone in the last year from having about 14 pantries to being able to have 50 and that's as a result of having this system Like we wouldn't have been able to do it without it. We would have failed, I think, if we hadn't have found this solution together. And the great thing about it is that it will wrap around us as an organisation as we grow. The main aim of the work with your local pantry was to build a system that could be easily accessed by individual pantries to record memberships and visits on a day to day basis. Being able to report on these in a visible format was very important, as was having robust induction and training resources for the volunteers who run the, who run the pantries. We use the NPSP membership software to support the back end management system and a suite of reports to demonstrate who is being helped, specifically looking at how many children benefit from the pantries. Each pantry location was set up as a separate organisation, which allows the members, visits and payments linked to each particular pantry to be tracked and reported on over time. As you can see, they have reported exponential growth in attendance, mainly due to the pandemic. But being able to see this in a visual form is very useful for funders and other partners. When the system was launched in December 2019, there were 500 monthly visits recorded. In March 2021, there were nine and a half thousand monthly visits. Economic change created a personalised community which each local pantry can access and add real time data for visits and payments. This can be linked back to existing members or new members can be created. Salesforce's mobile capabilities allow volunteers to log into the community via tablets and to record the relevant data for each visit. General feedback from the Your Local Pantry team is that this community is a very big reason that the franchise is so popular. The volunteers find it easy and intuitive to use. Your local pantry has done an extensive impact report, which they published in February, and the statistics are very impressive. 
And as Catherine said, the reason they have been able to do this is because of Salesforce and the reporting that we have built has allowed them to draw up this document, which can only help with their growth in the long run. Economic change sees the impact that Salesforce has on charities every day through the work that we do. But the work that we've done with your local pantry demonstrates how a simple solution can go a long way in making a huge impact on the on the communities that are being worked with, especially in these difficult times. We are very excited to continue supporting your local pantry as they grow as an organization and as Salesforce users. I'd just like to finish off with this last little video which shows exactly what your local pantry does. So we decided to open a pantry because we realised that we wanted some kind of alternative to a food bank. So we decided to go with your local pantry because it's a perfect package. It's got everything that we need. It had all the support in place, all the database, all the systems, all the IT. So we didn't have to reinvent the wheel. It was perfect. So a member comes along, they pay £3.50 and they can do the weekly shop and they, they get about £20 worth of shopping. So they all get 10 items, seven diamonds, three hearts, and all the fresh items are free. And we've got 200 memberships available. So it's absolutely brilliant because members are walking away with such a bag full of shopping. It's wonderful. It's only walking distance through with us the aim um, and everybody that's in here are absolutely brilliant always talking to you and making you feel welcome and the variety of the stuff as well and it's all healthy stuff and I can make a meal out of a couple of wee things that are in here so it's brilliant. It's totally made a big difference with money saving, definitely. I joined up and I paid my 350 subscription and got my, my shopping now and it's helped me immensely. I look forward to coming here on a Monday, it gives me a boost. If I'm feeling a wee bit lower, I feel really down, just remember, and it just clicks instantly in my head. You've not got your messages in. The savings I've got, uh, I'm not boasting, but just about everybody and their mother has got a Christmas present for me this year, and it wouldn't be possible if it wasn't for this food pantry. I think the thing about a pantry is it's about food with dignity, so people don't want to appear as though they're in crisis. And food banks certainly have their place, but the beauty of the pantry is that people are giving something to it. So with the membership fee, they feel as though they're able to give something and get something back. That's a really powerful model. We formed some really strong partnerships in North Edinburgh and when our partners saw the pantry model and they saw how successful it was, they decided that they wanted to open one as well, so Pennywell Pantry was born. If you can get involved in your local area, uh, it makes a difference to the people's lives, they save money uh, and I mean some people even commented that it's, uh, they can afford to eat now uh, most days through the week, so I mean that's, that's a big help. People are so chuffed and they're over the moon and they've been screaming out for it for a long, long time. I mean, we did have a community shop here a while ago and people really benefited from that and then it stopped. So I think people were choking for something to get back in the area. Personally, I really enjoy my role at the pantry. It's really helped me. I, I kind of suffer from mental health problems myself, so it's really been great for me and my confidence and in my local area as well. To anybody that's looking to set up a pantry, I would say it's very rewarding, it's a great idea, and yeah, do it, get involved. Great, thanks for listening. If you want to talk to us more about the work we do, give us a shout.